It was revealed on Thursday by Minister of Public Health, Wal Lawrence, that a total of 119 babies died in the neonatal unit of the Georgetown Public Hospital Corporation from June 1, 2017 to June 30, 2018. While the minister acknowledged that one death is one too much, she said the hospital was working to bring the number to zero. However, in the questioning segment, opposition parliamentarian Dr. Vidya Prasad wanted to know the cause of deaths. Minister Lawrence requested that the question be put in writing as she could not answer them immediately. A press release by the GPAC stated that the hospital wishes to assure the public that every life in a neonatal intensive care unit is precious to its staff and every death is distressing. Seeming to respond to Dr. Prasad's inquiries, the hospital sends out a public missive stating the following. The hospital is the home to the only level 3 NICU in Guyana. It is the only hospital that is capable of providing babies with invasive breeding support. The hospital receives the sickest and the most high-risk infants from both public and private medical institutions. The Georgetown Hospital has the capability to simultaneously support 18 babies in its NICU. However, because sick babies arrive every day, the admission numbers trend over this frequently. And the hospital provides care to all babies and does not turn away any sick baby. For the period June 2017 to June 2018, there were 6,409 live births, while from 2014, the annual deaths have been declining. For Channel 2 Headline News, Esther Sobers. Thanks for watching Headline News. Leave a like or a comment below. And for updates on the latest news happening in Guyana, click the subscribe button.